Hi friends, I am Sai Chaitanya. Welcome to Sai Tech Guru. In this video, I am going to talk about the one of the best application which is called uh, Free Navigation Gestures. So the reason why I am doing this review on this application is because by using this application, you can actually switch between the two applications uh, easily. Not only two friends, you can just uh, move between the applications very faster. As you can see, you can change between uh, all the multitasking applications in this way. So all the applications which are in the multitasking tray, just by uh, swiping and long pressing, you can uh, switch between apps. So this is the main reason why I'm doing this uh, review, which makes the multitasking very, very faster. And it doesn't matter which Android phone you are using, then definitely you need to download this application and try for yourself. So just comment below how is this application you're feeling and don't forget to uh, like this video friends and also share the video if it is very helpful. In, in this video, I'll be uh, explaining clearly how you can actually do that. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, SciTech Guru. And also do check the links in description for the Android application playlist. So which will be having same kind of Android application reviews, plenty of more in the playlist as well. And let's get started uh, with the fluid navigation gestures. So as you can see friends, it is uh, my uh, OnePlus 7 Pro device. And even if I use the full screen gestures, when I swipe, I cannot even go back to the previous application. In the previous, in the MI UI, it used to be there, but later even they got disabled. So now we need to find a third party application to actually do that. And it is the best application, which will be very, very helpful for you all. So let me try to open the applications. So as soon as you open, if you want to enable, you need to give the permissions to the two options, which is a application over display over and another is the accessibility two application permissions you need to give so once you allow the permissions uh, then you need to select the which uh, mode you want to choose how big the size is and uh, before that even you can select the left left side to one settings and right side to other settings even the bottom settings so usually i'll prefer to use the left and right itself because bottom i would prefer directly to go to the home screen so which is a faster and convenient way so instead of using any gestures so let me go to the uh, left edge so once you're in the left edge you do get this kind of options how many you can select so a number of actions also you can determine clearly so where as you can see so each uh each area you can allocate actual uh, separate set of actions to be done for example if you are using here it takes to the back and if you are using here it takes to the previous application as you can see clearly the arrow mark changes and same thing even you can uh, use different settings here so when you tap there so quick swipe and uh, swipe and load so overall friends you can add up to as you can see four and four into eight and eight different uh, settings you can actually choose just to the left side and uh, if you choose another eight to the right side then total of 16 different gestures you do get uh, in this application but mostly i would prefer to use the uh, two gestures which is a back and another is the previous uh, switching between two applications so which as uh, normally i'm doing as you can see here so let me go back to the google chrome and open the Play, play store and now let me demonstrate uh, how this works so when i swi swipe from the bottom of the screen it takes to the previous application you can clearly see the icon as well so google chrome application is running in the previous uh, multitasking tray and when i swipe here as you can see it takes to the google chrome and when i swipe it takes to the play store as well so that is the next application in the multitasking and if i swipe to the right as you can see here so which is pretty useful in terms of switching between the applications and next is when i swipe on the top in this area it only takes to the back as you can see just back page and this one takes to the back as well so this is how the triggering point uh, I have allocated in my device so uh, definitely friends if you are using any other phone uh, in the android application you can download this and you can install this kind of uh, triggering and you can use very good gestures without any problem and do let me know if you are having any other uh, applications in your mind and i'll be definitely uh, definitely reviewing these applications in my channel and thank you for watching this video for more videos do subscribe to my channel see you in the next video until then bye